Hi, I'm Sean Carruthers, and welcome to How Do I on Butterscotch.com. In this series, we're taking a look at how to use your digital SLR camera, and specifically in this episode, we're going to take a look at manual mode. Now, on the mode dial on the top, you would want to dial M for manual. That'll allow you to take control of all of the settings on your camera, not just one or allowing it to go into full automatic mode. Now, there's a few reasons you may want to do this. When you go into shutter priority mode or aperture priority mode, you select the aperture or the shutter setting and the camera compensates by selecting the other one to get a good picture. Sometimes that'll do the job. In other times, you may find yourself with a picture that isn't quite what you wanted. Now, on the Canon camera, we have this mode dial up here that allows you to select things and that will select the shutter speed. And in full manual mode, you need to select both of them. So typically there's another button here that you use. In this case it's the AV mode. You hold that down and that'll adjust the aperture setting. So just look in your manual to find out how you actually adjust both of them. It may not be obvious when you uh, first pull the camera out of the box. Now the one thing that's worth noting is it does take a lot of practice. Uh, unless you've taken a photography course it's not 100% clear how each of these settings will work together. So if you're just learning it is worth taking this out, going into manual mode, and just playing around with it, seeing how each of the, the settings does adjust the shot. Take a shot, change the setting, take another shot, change the setting, and keep doing that until you are certain you know it, uh, what will happen when you do those two things under various lighting conditions. So it, again, it does take practice, but it can be rewarding, especially if you find yourself taking a shot in shutter priority mode and realizing that it's not 100% what you wanted. Then you just take those settings, go into manual mode, tweak it from there. The other thing manual mode allows you to do is to take the shot wrong on purpose. So taking a shot correctly is good if you want to see what's in the shot, but sometimes you might be going for an artier effect. So for example, this picture of the Las Vegas sign, taking the picture properly will expose everything. You may in fact want to get just the light itself and have everything else around it dark. Otherwise you might want to overexpose, for example, and take a picture and have a, a sort of white look around the whole thing. It can create an artistic effect that you can't get when your camera is adjusting things properly to take the picture in a correct way. So again, you may want to do this for artistic purposes rather than just compensating for something that you wanted to see that the camera isn't delivering. Anyways, that's it for the manual mode on the digital SLR camera. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out the other parts in this series.